hello friends in this video i am going to discuss paradise lost i'll discuss introduction to writer plot analysis character analysis theme analysis and simple anal analysis of this uh, epic this uh, epic poem so let's begin by a brief introduction of writer john milton milton was a son of a protestant composer and he became proficient in several languages graduated from cambridge 1632 and uh, his famous work includes pastoral poems lycidas and milton went into hiding and composed paradise lost and uh, he was completely blind by that time and uh, he dictated this poem his to his daughter who write uh, this and uh, he become he die of due to kidney failure at the age of 65 and historical context of this op um, poem is that milton was you know a protestant christian opposed to catholicism and anglican church that hold power in england at that time and milton still filled it with allusions to politics of present day england we'll see in certain speeches how the he relate with present day politics and uh, his related literary works this work has been influenced by bible and uh, the reference is bible and he gives allusions to homer's odyssey Iliad, and uh, virgil's a knight and uh, it's a uh, precursor in the genre of epic poetry it's an epic poem and now we'll see some effects full title paradise laws written 1658 to 1663 and published in 1674 revised edition and uh, period renaissance and restoration period epic poetry setting heaven earth paradise and hell and uh, climax is uh it's the forbidden fruit and point of view third person omniscient and we'll see that uh, a revolutionary aspect of this paradise lost it that it lacks rhyme and now we'll see the plot summary of this epic poem milton first initially as we see in all the epics that the writer invokes a muse a muse to write that so milton invokes a heavenly muse to help him to describe the fall of man which is the subject matter of paradise lost book one the action begins with this Saturn and his devils in uh, hell after they have been defeated by god's army because they rebels against god and the devils then construct a pandemonium you can call this a uh, capital in the hell a meeting place and builds a a second command of the devils and he give idea to corrupt the god's new creation that is earth so they were intended to corrupt the creation on earth as they realized that they cannot defeat their creator the god as he lives the satan lives hell and meet his children sin and death and that god already predict the satans will corrupt humans because god knows god has the knowledge of future and son offers son here refers to jesus christ according to christian faith the son jesus christ the son of god who ever offer sacrifice himself for the sake of humanity and then he saw so what satan pretend to be a cherub cherub is an angel it's a rank of angel and then uh, sneak past the angelic god satan enters paradise to corrupt adam and eve and then what happens there satan turns into a toad whispering to eve and the archangel Gabriel finds satan and confront him satan consider fighting but god hangs a golden scales in the sky so satan get afraid and he flees he run away and he woke up from that dream and uh, to ensure that the couple's free will god has given us free will you know God has knowledge of all that what's going to happen. God has everyone, everything is decided in faith. Yet we have free will. And God sends the angel Raphael to warn Adam and Eve about the Satan. Raphael's it with the Adam Eve and describe the Satan 
war in heaven the uh, how he rebels against god the rebel like experience pain and uh couldn't be killed because they were given pain forever they'll suffer forever in the hell and raphael tell the story of creation of earth and after several days saturn returns to eden and uh now he take the shape of a serpent and eve suggests that she and adam work separately and she ask how he learned to speak she was surprised to see her a serpent is speaking and satan says that he ate the fruit of tree of knowledge and he suggests that you should eat that fruit to prove her courage and become goddess god like power and eve has that at first because it was forbidden by god to eat that fruit and uh, and he the satan as a serpent describe her that he has eaten the fruit so that Uh, he he possessed such powers to speak and he didn't die so he convinced eve to eat that fruit she eat that fruit and uh, also she make adam to eat that fruit so that they cannot get spread it and for the sake of love adam also eat that fruit so that eve and adam could not get spread it meanwhile satan returns to hell and sent sin and death to infect the earth and satan and the devils are punished for being turned into serpent forever adam and eve then after realizing their mistake they blame each other for uh, that mistake that blunder and they fight with each other adam suggests that they have revenge on satan by being obedient to god again and they both we repent lament on what they have done and god sends michael to expel the couple from paradise for that disobedience they have been expelled from paradise forever and michael shows adam a vision of the future including his children's crime and many sinful generation and uh, the son the jesus christ sacrifice a ton for the fall and save humanity one day it was predicted and now we'll see character analysis we'll see major characters satan the greatest enemy of god ruler of hell prince of hell you can call it his original name was erase rest and his name was lucifer in once he was in heaven a, a bitent high rank angel and after his rebellion he was named as satan which means the adversary and he became jealous of god and then he was too proud about himself and then he refused to uh obey god's command and he realized that hell so that he built an army and fight against god and got defeated and sent to hell he realized that hell is inside his soul and he can never escape suffering and uh, he is antagonist of this poem and dynamic and interesting character we'll see certain character analysis in a separate video and god the father refers to the god almighty the ruler creator of universe but uh, in christian faith the concept of trinity means three the first god his son jesus christ and third part holy spirit as we know that god is all powerful all knowing and it uh, demands we are obliged to uh, have submit our obedience before god because we are his creators and god has given us a free will and only god for his future and then the son jesus christ an important part of faith in christianity and there has the uh, concept that the son resurrect one day and uh, save humanity from that suffering and uh, the son later becomes incarnate as jesus whose body is rise from the dead after defeat defeating death even resurrection and adam the first human and father of mankind you know sent and wise milton summon as inherently superior superior to women adam is greater than eve, eve in wisdom strength and closeness to god as well eve the first woman who created out of adam's rib slightly inferior to him and she was the first to eat Uh, that forbidden fruit and tempted by satan 
and cast the fall and the sin uh, which which is described as a character satan's daughter spring from his head and god gives her the gifts to hell but she gives them to satan and she gives birth to death which enter earth after the fall inflicting humans with sin and death uh, another son of Satan described as a character, a black terrifying figure that enter earth after the fall and cause all life to come to him. And some minor characters in this poem is Mikhail, greatest archangel, leader of heaven's army, and uh, Jibril, a second in command of heaven's army, Uriel, who guards the Eden, Raphael, God sends him to warn Adam and Eve, uh, Eve about satan and abdel the only angel among satan's legions to return to god's side and bilzebub satan second in command prince uh, of uh, devils he was known as you might heard about him in in your dr fastest and Moloch, a devil who, who later become a false god and Belial, who was again a devil, who was educated for this lot, and Mehmet, a greedy devil, a false god, who loved riches. Malsibar, uh, an architect who designed the pandemonium, and Chaos, the raw dark materials as a character play, and Night, the Chaos concert, and the Muse, the figure of divine inspiration. Uh, at the beginning of this poem, we will see that. Um, uh, the writer Milton invoked to Muse to write this poem and Ithuril who finds Satan in the form of a thought who was an angel and Ziphon Ziphon is another angel who finds Satan and brings him before Gabriel the Holy Spirit the third in Trinity of and Christian faith and then Cain and Abel, Adam's and Eve's first children, and Cain kills Abel out of jealousy, and from that, uh, the death occurs to human. It begins, and other characters including Enoch, righteous man, Noah, only righteous man of later generation, and who built an ark and restart humanity after after god destroyed the earth with a flood and numrod a tyrant king who tries to build the tower of Babel, and abraham uh, a man an angel not angel uh, a prophet according to islam in islamic faith a man who leaves his adulterous parent parents and choose Islam and Pharaoh the Egyptian ruler who enslaves the Israelis Moses Moses a rightful prophet Israelis from Israelis who flees his people from Egypt and Joshua Moses successor David a greatest Israeli king you might heard about King David a prophet in Islam and sister of Jesus and Mary uh, Mariam you can call the virgin mother of Jesus and now we'll see the themes and the first theme is uh, hierarchy and order so the universal there is a universal hierarchy and order that these events are taking place and if something upset that hierarchy is set by the God and in 17th century the views of the cosmos heaven exist above earth below and hell below the earth and that of god has supreme monarch the creator ruler of the universe has only begotten son and then it's believed that below these are there's order that first the creator the god and then uh, his son according to christianity and then uh, Below that are archangels and then other angels arranged in different categories and ranks. And when God creates earth, he set Adam and Eve in rank above all other creatures and Adam and Eve in terms of authority and wisdom. 
above all creatures and the devils of hell are lowest in rank so this is hierarchy of the god the way of god this hierarchy cannot be ups uh, upset so milton felt god has the rightful ruler of all uh, while monarchies were not and then the paradise lost is uh, the moral lesson is that the hierarchy of heaven earth must be respected and upheld and that the evil in the world is the result of an upset of that divine order and second theme is disobedience and revolt paradise lost is you know the subject matter of this poem is all about fall of man and fall of man which caused due to disobedience of god and also the rebellion revolt of satan against his creator god so the fall comes when satan grows jealousy of god honoring the sun so highly so he claims that they should be honored as god the angels must be honored as god not that humans that god created not have to worship god and his son so he rebels and got defeated in the battle of heaven and satan was defeated sent to hell so he plots to corrupt humanity as he gave up on that he could not defeat his uh, creator god so he tried some other means to uh, harm his enemy that is god so he plots to corrupt humanity and the subject of the poem that become adam and eve disobeying god by creating by eating that fruit of tree of knowledge which god has forbidden and this single act of disobedience leads to fall of men and christian explanation for all the suffering and evil in this world and god shows mercy in sending his son to redeem that humanity that is jesus christ when this hierarchy is upset the result is always pain and punishment another theme is sin and innocence so this paradise loss is dramatization exaggeration of the original sin original sin is the concept or the idea that the sin is inherent in humanity in humans so the world earth is created and uh, for a christian like milton sin is everything that break god laws or disobey god's order and heaven of good angels and original paradise are both innocent places free from any sin or any devil and uh, and then we'll see the original sin of adam and eve is then ultimate fall from innocence and their act introduced sin into this vault and and we'll see that the forbidden tree gives adam and eve knowledge but along with the knowledge of evil it, it brings evil to the earth and this single disobedience act spirals quickly to lust greed pride jealousy and uh, these are our visions of future in which there seems no innocent left on earth brothers mother brothers we'll see now in this world the same thing happens and disease suffering rule people worship false god and the only hope for the future is coming of god's son jesus who will bring who redeem humanity and another important theme is free will and predestination being a muslim we totally believe in predestination that everything is predestined by god almighty the role of, we believe in role of fate the fate has been written by god and uh, we cannot change it in paradise lost milton argues that though the god forces the fall of men he still didn't influence adam and eve's free will uh, yet he has given free will to adam eve as well as for, to the satan and he gives his creatures the opinion to serve or disobey there is no obligation or any coercion we have freedom we have free will and predestination that god has already decided who is going to hell and who is to heaven and god already predicts how he will to remedy it and give greater glory to himself by sending his son to die and restore the order of heaven and the idea says that god allowed the fall of men so that he could uh, bring good out of it possibly more good than than would have occur within the fall 
and be able to show his love and power through incarnation of his son and in this way free will of adam and eve and also that of satan remains basically free and still fits into god our arching plan and then another important theme is theme of love and marriage and the angel sees leslie worship god and commune with each other in joy and the son offers himself as sacrifice for humankind out of love for them and uh, so there is a shift in focus to mortal love and idea of marriage as well there is concept of divine love as well uh, the love uh, for god among the creatures and milton creates a picture of marital love that is innocent pure and still invokes sexuality and it's the love that has tempted that has compelled adams to eat that fruit it's love for uh eve that uh, he cannot live without eve or get separated from eve so for the sake of love he eat that fruit and love of god should came before romantic love and uh, so when adam chose to disobey god commandment for the sake of eve's love and so this romantic love leads to their fall and now we'll see symbols so the first symbol is fruit the fruit of tree of knowledge and the fruit of tree of knowledge is the only fruit that god has forbidden them to eat and she hopes so if it that she hopes to gain knowledge god like powers and value and uh, in itself the fruit gives knowledge of good and evil and the importance of fruit is that that they eat it despite god's commandment or god um, forbidden and the knowledge that the tree gives is not inherently sinful but disobeying god by eating that fruit is tree of fruit, fruit of that tree is sinful and a single small thing that represents the cause of all evils and suffering in this world and second important symbol is the skull scales in in the sky the scales on which god weighed the outcomes of every event that we have a concept that uh, everything should be measure the good deed and bad deeds in a balance once having good deeds heavier than bad deeds they go to heaven and the one who sins our way the goodness they'll go to hell so the scales the scales of god are there and the scales represents god uh, supreme power or both his angels and rebellious devils as he exists outside of time and knows all possible futures and we'll see that uh, satan is forced to resort to fraud and trickery trickery instead of open revolt and then he only accepts god allow him to and he accept the power of god the scales as well so this is all the video will go too long i'll make a uh, separate video on important chords and their explanation as well notes are in the description if you have queries you can write in comment or follow us on insta and fp page link in the description thank you for watching